Well, he just turned 22 this week, but Chris Nickich, who has Down syndrome, has already accomplished an incredible athletic feat, finishing an Ironman. Wow. Now, as yeah. WBZ's Liam Martin shows us, he has set his sights on the Boston Marathon. You woke up this morning as a boy with Down syndrome, you're going home as an Ironman. Chris Nickich is not like everybody else. In fact, he's better. At the age of 21, he did the Panama City Ironman in Florida. That's 2.4 miles of open water swimming, 112 miles of biking, and 26.2 miles of running. And it was anything but easy. I had that bite on my leg. Yeah, you stopped for nutrition. He stepped on a pile of ants. He was essentially running with uh, poisonous welts throughout his bottom part of his body. And yet, despite the bites and utter exhaustion, Chris finished to a sea of embraces. History in the making of Chris Pickett, that first down syndrome that ever finished an Iron Man. It was the hugs. The hugs? Yeah. It's all that matters is the hugs at the end. Yeah. And now Chris is eyeing his next challenge, the Boston Marathon. His father says it's all about their motto, getting 1% better every day. And it's essentially just one more every every time he works out. He started out with one push-up, one sit-up, and one squat. Eventually, he got to doing 200. Now he's up to 380. Chris has been honored with two SB Sports Awards, is a public speaker, and has his own book, 1% Better, to inspire others. I'm going to do this. Get up here, work hard. And his father believes the sky is the limit for his son. Imagine at 1% improvement what Chris can do by 25, by 30, by 35, by 50. And, and that's really, you know, wherever we're starting, um, this process can make our lives that much better going forward. And when Chris reaches the Boston Marathon finish line, well, his plans are similar to any other 22 year old. <laughs> and there's much more to come for Chris. He plans to run the New York, Tokyo, and Disney marathons, the Hawaii Ironman next year, and the Special Olympics next summer. He's going to be very busy. I'm Liam Martin, WBZ News. <laughs> Is it possible that he can't get that much better because he's, he's already so fantastic? Amazing. What an athlete. I don't know. If he can go nightclubbing after the Boston Marathon, then uh, I want what he's having. <laughs> you know, after a sporting event, sometimes they say they're going to Disney World. Right. You're going nightclubbing. <laughs> like it. Absolutely. It's all right here. Love it. WBZ is proud to be your Boston Marathon station. Hopefully, we'll see Chris right there at the finish line on Monday. The 125th running is Monday. Our coverage starts at WBZ this morning at 4.30. Stay with us for the pre-race show at 7 o'clock. The first athletes take off at 8 o'clock.